today I'll be unboxing my copy of a limited runs game. It's the very first game from li limited run games that is made for the Switch. So this is the very first product I've ever ordered from Limited Run Game. So let's see what we've got here. Make sure there's nothing else in there. No, we're good. Okay, so those of you, of you that don't know, the first game is Thimbleweed Park. So this is a kind of mystery adventure game, I think kind of a whodunit kind of story game, um, and I believe it's made by some of the people that used to work at LucasArts back in the day, so it uh, should be pretty good, and I think it's gotten pretty good reviews from what I've seen, but I uh, haven't seen any negative talk about it. So there it is, limited run, number zero zero one. Nintendo Switch Pro controller compatible, so that's good. Now let's see what else we have here. We have, oh, so this is cool. Um, Looks like I accidentally cut the card while I was cutting the package open, but that's okay, I guess. Um, nothing I can really do about it, but I'll give you a little, looks like kind of a trading card thing here for the game. And then we have, what is this here? A, it says, if you can't read it, Limited run, this counts as one ticket towards a limited run game's loyalty reward. Um, <laughs> I suppose I should probably cover up the number there, but I imagine by the time I post this video, I'll probably have used it anyway. So let's go ahead and open this up. Oh wow, okay, so open it up and you get Thimbleweed Park on a physical cartridge as well as looks like a little manual. It's definitely better than nothing. Not even Nintendo games have this. So Thimbleweed Park, Nintendo Switch, kind of got credits. Or mini credits, I guess you could say, and the full credits are available at that website. They've got an about here. So to the next page, we've got a little getting started, kind of explaining the controls. Um, and apparently, it's got touch screen controls. So that's neat, that'll be fun to check it out. Flip over to the next page. Kind of more touch screen controls, how to save it, how to load it, in case you've never played a video game before. Um, and that is pretty much it. Some hints. Our game design philosophy. We follow Gilbert's rules for making action, uh, making adventure games, not action adventure games. This isn't God of War or anything like that. So, 
that is the unboxing of Thimbleweed Park. Pretty cool. Um, I'm definitely going to be ordering more from Limited Run Games in the future, I think. Um, and this really wasn't that expensive. $30 for a really nice package or a pretty decent game. I'm not sure how much it is on the eShop, but I'll gladly pay the premium for, you know, the case and really cool artwork. And wow, I didn't think to look to see if this has reversible artwork or not, because I think some of the limited run stuff does. Um, not really, no. I mean, I guess you could turn it around if you wanted to, but no. So yeah, that's it. If you like this video, you know what to do. If you don't like it, that's fine too. Go ahead and give it a thumbs down. Otherwise, stay tuned for a review here in the near future. Thank you.